Let's get a look at our highlights from the second half of this one. Anthony Roberts somewhat held in check. He gets around his season average a little more than that with 22, but MSC Moore had made him earn it. The thing was, he never went on big streaks where he took over the game. We've seen him do that in games this year. He never got in that kind of rhythm today. Trevor Kaiser was excellent off the bench, 12 points. Remember, he was a starter at UMary last season, averaging 17, 12 tonight for MSUM. Yeah, he did a really nice job spotting up, hitting a few shots on from the three-point line, taking it hard to the rim, threw it on the glass as well. Really helped contribute in a lot of ways. Gador Queth also key off the bench with 11. Yeah, I thought his energy was just terrific. He scores 11 points and only playing 19 minutes. Uh, I thought those were huge buckets that he was able to get in and around the bucket, and, and excuse me, in the paint, and also six rebounds to go along with it. Five and double figures for each side, except all five for St. Cloud State were starters, and three of the five for Emerson Moorhead were from the bench as we get a look at the final numbers. Edge and points in the paint, but again, the bench points total 43 to 6. This has been the MO because you mentioned the past couple games. They had yep. 61 bench points in their last game of the regular season, 57 the game before that. So that's three straight games with more than 40 bench points. Yeah, I mean, they're getting in this case not quite half, but right at near that. And uh, I tell you, when you have that kind of depth, I mean, it can really help you in a tournament format where you're playing back to back days. I thought another huge thing is they were able to flip the rebounding. They were minus four was MSU Moorhead in the first half on the glass. They ended up with a 12 rebound advantage in the second half and eight O boards. That gave them those extra possessions and had a great second half offensively. And they matched their average for the season as far as the game is concerned. 11 offensive rebounds total leading to 16 second chance points in what ends up being a 15 point victory.